Welcome to my channel, it's Life is VM. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And if you're coming back, welcome back. So today, I'm going to do a video telling you what I use. Um, some of the stuff I use every day, some of the stuff I don't use every day. And you know, I just wanted to share. Also put down in the comments what you use as well, because you might be able to give me some tips. All right, so let's get started. So first, we're gonna talk about what I use to, um, you know, just cleanse my body, wash my face, stuff like that. So we'll start with the water. So first we have from Butter, this Geno Cleanser, and I love this. It doesn't have any smell to it. Um, according to the description, it removes unwanted impurities while enriching essential oils and maintaining skin's natural pH. So I got this from Ulta and I'm almost done. And they say it takes about 30 days to really see how your skin reacts to things and if it's working, you know. But I love this. I really do love this. I feel like I'm gonna get more. So that's first. Naterium's Half Step Flash Facial. And with this, um, you use it in between your first and second cleanse so if you some people wash their face twice the majority of the time I'll wash my face twice especially after you wear makeup um, this actually still wet from the shower <laughs> but um, this actually has vegan lactate acids plus biodegradable cellulose so I know they have body washes also but I love this and it kind of like cleanses your face in between that first wash it also exfoliates a little bit and it's very gentle um, you do want to wear sunscreen with this um, and it says you can use it maybe one to two times a week and I really do love this stuff um, you can leave it on your face for five minutes. You gently massage it into your skin and rinse off thoroughly. So one or two times a week, not too much, and it'll leave your skin feeling so soft. I love this, and I'll probably get this again. I can't remember how much it costs, but um, yeah. And I feel like I ordered this straight from um, Naturium. Naturium, is that how you say their name? These little pods that I use to well, sponges that I use to wash my face. Um, and they look like this initially whenever you first use them. They're flat. And then when you put the water on them, they look like this. I love these things. It kind of like um, gives you like a little mini exfoliating every day. And I love that. Um, so this is what they'll look like. This is what they start with. This is what they'll end up looking like. And I love these because they're good to clean your face instead of using like a dirty washcloth. Even though I use um, like a lot of antibacterial things. I use color bleach. I use this Lysol thing. Also this Oxy thing when I wash my clothes because you got to get your clothes clean. But I love like thick washcloths. I don't like those little cheap washcloths. Now, no shade to you if that's what you use. But I like to have like a luxurious thick washcloth you feel me that's what i like so that's that sticking in the same category i have these cotton towels it has no scent friendly to the skin no residue i love these um it comes in a pack of 80 you can use them dry you can use them wet so like when you go ahead and wash your face with these and you just want to kind of have like the washcloth effect these these cotton towels and instead of using like I said that the washcloth even though you know I believe in the power of soap and water for sure but you got to make sure that you know you take care of that skin and what you put on it and that includes what you're cleaning it with so this is what they look like this is my open pack because when I got them I had ordered um, two packs because they they weren't that much on Amazon and of course, it doesn't have to be this one. You can get any cloth that you would like. Just, you know, don't be using those 
washcloths on your face. At least I don't. You can do what you want to do. But for the most part, I don't use washcloths on my face anymore. So this is what they look like. Okay. So next, sticking with the face. Maybe we should just stick with um, shower. So we'll stick with that for now. The the shower. Okay. Daily Concepts Exfoliating Dual Texture Scrubber. And this is for like, you know, your whole body. You have to exfoliate, especially during these cool winter months. You want to make sure that you get your skin summer ready. So you could be smooth and glowing. Okay. So this is what it looks like. This is my second one. And it even has that you replace me when the writing fades. So that's good. Let's you know. Because you know, sometimes you may not know how long you've had it. And you're like, girl, is it time for a new one or not? This will let you know. So basically, I have the scrubber and you just, you know, scrub, scrub, scrub all over so you can keep that glow. 24-7. 365. I got this from Ulta and it's basically just um it has double texture it's ideal for the whole body so you don't have to worry about that and it has a hand strap so it's easy to use so it's not going to slip out of your hand because you just okay next body wash and girl it smells It's actually called the Wind Down Body Wash. It has, excuse me, plant-based cleansers, good vibes inside. So it's the uh, Method Chamomile Starflower Blue Lavender Wind Down. That's a lot. That's a mouthful, girl. But it is worth it, okay? So it says that you can use this after a long day. It's infused with chamomile, starflower, blue lavender, and it, it calms your body. It's a calming body wash. Moisturize, smelling like bedtime bliss. But I'm not gonna lie, I use this whenever. It's not just the nighttime. I use it in the daytime also because it smells so good. So you know, if you take a shower in the daytime, if you take a shower at nighttime, it doesn't matter. I love this stuff. It smells so good. So next up, we have this Materium, the Brightener Vitamin C Body Wash, gently cleanses, exfoliates, and brightens for radiant looking skin. And it does just that, baby. It has natural fruit acids, enzymes, and some other stuff. So I love this stuff. I love, um, there's the purple one. I haven't tried the purple one, but you're getting ready to see the other ones that I've tried. But I love this stuff. Um, you just apply a generous amount in your washcloth or loofah or whatever, but it's like a gel creamy body wash it's formulated with um highly stable vitamin c derivative fruit acids and they smell so good like i love these things i love them so much and i love them two of them i got from target like i said i haven't tried the lavender looking one or the purplish bluish color one if you've tried that let me know down in the comments how you like that but I feel like that's for sensitive skin. I could be wrong, but for whatever reason, in line, um, I have the Multivitamin Daily Nutrients Body Wash. Now this one, for the most part, even though it says daily, I may not use this every day, but like I said, I use one of the three that, I, um, that I'm going to show you. And so this one is a rich body wash formulated with mild plant-based girl I don't know but anyway I really like these and it does I did see a difference in my skin you know with the whole routine that I'm doing especially using these I love these a multivitamin daily nutrients body wash and with omega fatty acids and you know that is great for the skin who doesn't love a, a body wash with multivitamin okay so the next one I have I don't know if you can get this one the next one I have I don't know if you can get this one in the store but it's the Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Wash, and it's, it and it smells good too. I just want to smell this like the top off. But it starts out with like a, cause it says it's the Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Wash, and it's an oil to gel formula, right? And so that intense nourishes it says. And so 
Oh, it smells so good. I, mean, I love this stuff. And you just apply a generous amount, work it in, rinse it off, girl. You will love your skin. I love these. I think these are all worth the money. And it even has glycerin. You know glycerin is really good for the skin. I really love these. So, 10 out of 10, all of these, I do recommend. And again, there's one I haven't tried, but if you've tried it, let me know. I might be missing out on something. We have to help each other here. Let me do it that way. Next, I have Glow Melanin. And I really love Glow Melanin. Um, I did have, I do have a code for Glow Melanin, and I will leave it in the description box. So check that out. You know, um, help your your little quint. But um, this is the turmeric brightening scrub, and I love this. I even left a comment on their Instagram. This is the only thing that worked for my hyperpigmentation. I had some scars on my legs because I had eczema and I would like scratch, and nothing would work, not even the medical grade um, lightening cream that they gave me worked. And so I was really upset because you know, I was like, oh my gosh, everything else is clear. My face is clear, I don't have any skin problems. You know, I take care of my skin. What am I gonna do about this? And so, this was the only thing that worked. And this is about empty. No, it is empty. You know how they say with makeup, you hit pan? Honey, I hit plastic, okay? This works very good. It's time for me to re-up. They need to sponsor me. Glow Melanin, you see this? I love this stuff, okay? Love it. And what you do is, um, well for me when I'm in the shower I'll go ahead and um, I even put it under my armpits you know how sometimes when you use razors you'll get that dark look um, I have been using the wrong kind of razor for a long time trying different razors you know so on and so forth but this baby this helps within like 30 days this is like my second time ordering this and love it I don't think I'll ever stop using this. I love this stuff. So I get in the shower, you know, before like I really wash, wash, and scrub. And knees too, girl, and elbows too. You know, that's really important. Knees, elbows, armpits. And, you know, I'm assuming we're all 18 and older here. Lady parts too. Well, you know how you can get dark down there or whatever? This too. Love this. Love it. Get you some of this, girl. You need this in your life. Get you some. Next, I have this Monistat Feminine Cleanser with boric acid. I love this stuff too. Enough said, it does what it says it's gonna do. That's it, get you some of this. Okay. Next up we have these Witch Hazel Soothing Multi-Use Cleansing Cloths. It says it's for oily, irritated, red, damaged, blemished, or inflamed skin. It's 99% natural astringent. So I'm assuming you can use these on your face. It's a pack of 25. And I got these at um, CVS. I never use these on my face because I already have a, a toner. I forgot to show you my toner. I'll show you my toner. But anyway, I do use these to stay like fresh. You can freshen up with these. I mean, I don't actually use it on my actual girl. However, I use it around the girl. So like after you wash and um, after you shower, take a bath, whatever you like girl, whatever. So after you shower, I use this to you know wipe around the lady part, wipe around your girl and the behind. This will keep you smelling fresh for a very, very long time. You know, in between showers, after shower, whatever. Just you know, because that's where the oil and the bacteria is, you know, when you sweat and stuff like that. This will keep you smelling fresh. So, get you some of these. So, next up, sticking with oral hygiene. Of course, I think we're going to use dental floss, right? If you're not, what are you doing with your life? But anyway, so I like this TheraBreath Dentist Formulated Fresh Breath Oral Rinse. It eliminates bad breath for 12 hours. 12 hours it has no alcohol in it I actually use this <clears throat> and the non-alcohol Lister Listerine the purple one <coughs> now I see why they be having drinks child my throat is dry 
actually use this one and the purple Listerine and that's no alcohol in that one too because I feel like alcohol dries your breath out which leads to bacteria which stinks makes your breath stink from what I understand and so I love this stuff it is a little you know a little bit pricey but I feel like it's worth it maybe like six seven dollars depending on where you get it from you get it from Target you know they're gonna hit you over the head but we love Target so next I forgot to show you the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelette Night Common. And again, I use it when I want, how I want, where I want. Because once you buy it, according to my aunt, you can use it how you want. It's yours to do so. So even though it says a night common, I love these because it smells so good. Um, they are alcohol free, allergy tested, dermatologist tested. You can even use these on your eyes because it says ophthalmologist tested. So, which I do, you know, I use it to wipe off my makeup like that and so love this it comes in a set of 25 pre moistened towelettes even waterproof mascara so that's why I love them and so for makeup you know when you have your makeup on take it off self-explanatory but I do recommend these and I love them the toothpaste that I use I love Colgate over Crest fight with your mama not me it's toothpaste but I like the deep clean penetrates between teeth and a rush of clean. This is the brisk mint flavor and has micro foaming action. So I mean I like Colgate for the most part. I normally use the one with the baking soda and the whitening but because um, you know I had that lip blush that you should have seen in the previous video. If you haven't go back and watch that then come and watch this one but um, you're not supposed to use like whitening whenever you have the lip blush so like I said I normally use the Colgate baking soda and peroxide toothpaste but this was a good alternative so yeah try this out because they sell this in the dollar 25 trim for sure I also for me you may not need this but for me I need Sensodyne and I like this because like sometimes when you have like or when I have cold things or even just like water from my um water pick flosser it will be really a lot to take and it be like and then it'll go away but my dentist recommended I use I use that sometimes my teeth get a little sensitive but anyway next up we have this this is the Philips Sonicare and this particular um, version of it or it has clean white and gum care so you can change it and it also lets you know when it's time to change your toothbrush head as well so I got this because it was recommended by my dentist to get it and I'm a real stickler for oral hygiene I love this thing okay because a regular toothbrush I cr no it just won't do like you have to you have to try it so anyway I recommend an electric toothbrush over um, you know using your hand the regular you know I just do you got to try it so don't knock it till you try it because I've used a regular toothbrush and I just mm, and not trust me I'm oral hygiene for real for real freak I just, mm, mm, mm. but this one just it does something the electric toothbrush is just it's amazing it's even let me know it's time to charge my battery if I'm not mistaken and it can go a very long time if you didn't see my video on this toothbrush go watch it it's not it's not super long uh, it was like an unboxing and I really love this too I recommend using a water pick which is like a, a water flosser I use regular dental floss as I told you earlier but I also use this water flosser and I really like this because it gets like the gunk between your teeth you know sometimes if you brush your teeth you may still have like that that taste like mm, they might need something this this will help you can do it before and after brushing I do that sometimes I do it like before and after it has like um you know the little button right here it comes with I also did an unboxing on this too so you need to watch that video too bro. but so you can see everything it comes with but I love this thing like it's battery operated the batteries last a really long time because it doesn't use like a lot of energy um, to make it work not energy whatever girl. It doesn't use a lot of power to make it work 
but it is very powerful if that makes sense i love this water pick they have different versions of it you know you don't have to get this particular one but i do know that i had got one from amazon it was like an off brand sometimes those off brands don't really work but i'm saying they have different versions of the water pick so definitely get you one try it you won't regret it they that i use the intuition i believe it's by venus um again the razor that you use definitely has an effect on your results and also you know like razor bumps things like that you know those little cheap pink razors that people get from like wherever walmart dollar tree those things will tear you up girl don't do it okay so basically um i like this razor because it has either four or five blades on it and then it has like i don't know if you can see like around the actual razor part girl it has this block of goodness honey okay this razor is it is on the little bit pricey side but i feel like it's worth it like anything that i get it's worth it okay so it can be like eight nine dollars something like that but i noticed an immediate difference like the shave it almost feels like you're not shaving anything because it doesn't hurt or you know like those cheap razors girl um now i do every now and then i do wax also but i'm saying if you need to shave or you just shave or you're not with the wax or whatever this is the one for you they have a sensitive one also but this is my favorite i don't really like the sensitive one you know like i say you could try it and you might like it but i don't like the sensitive one it's green so this is the one that i recommend and you can get you know replacement cartridges or whatever it normally comes with a replacement cartridge also so this is a really good razor and like i said this thing around here you don't need soap because you know how people would shave with soap or you know shaving cream you don't need that because it comes with it it's like a built-in and it's easy to put on take off when it's time to replace i really do love this razor and like i said if you get the cheap razor you have to you know deal with the dark underarms and stuff like that and you don't want that you know um ingrown hairs on your lady you don't want that so get you a razor that invest in your razor okay Nobody wants to see tree climbers, okay? Your feet looking good. That from CVS on sale. Cause CVS will hit you over the head, girl. They, they will do this to you. But I love a CVS sale. So it looks like this. I'm not even gonna lie, I have used this already. Can't tell right now, but don't judge me. So I love this. It was, I feel like it was 20 bucks, but I got it for $9.99 at CVS and it comes with let me see let me take it out and i love this thing because like i said in my previous video i was trying to not go to the nail salon because it was tearing up my nails even though you know i love the nails and they're really cute but when you put the press-ons on you can do this like you know still take care of your natural nail even though the press on nails are cute and file them buff them and this is actually what it does you can file you can buff see it has um everything on it to tell you what to do you can see that it's on that but you know file clean up your nails right before you put those press on so even if you don't do press on nails just Basically, um, prep your nails. That's what it does. You can put the different 
heads on. Let me put the head on and show you. And it slips right in, girl. Oh, well, wrong way. And it slips right in, just like that. And it has different settings. You can reverse, go the opposite way. I love this thing. I really do. You can see it tells you everything that it does. It's my little light on it too girl so that way if you are you know traveling and your man's driving honey and you need to hurry up and snip 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 do a little quick one two okay you can do that we love that Okay, next, I want to say I love. Next up, we have Hey Humans. I love this this deodorant. I would recommend this deodorant to anyone. A lot of people down natural deodorants, but this is the one. And I'm I'm I'm, I'm kind of upset because I get this from Target, and I even saw it in Walmart, but I never got it from Walmart. And whenever I got it from Target. They stopped carrying it, and I even had to get the little associates. You know how they have the Target apps on their phones, or maybe they have the employee Target app. I don't know. But for some reason, it seems like now. And I'm still getting used to what it looks, so I don't know. But it seems like they no longer carry it, according to the associate. I was so upset. I was like, girl, what is the problem? Where is different um, scent but this one is coconut mint <sighs> this stuff smells so good like I'll even hug people and I'm like is that your deodorant is, is that your? my aunt she hugged me and she was like is that your deodorant and I was like girl yes <laughs> it is this stuff is free of parabens and propylene glycol whatever that is can't even barely pronounce it don't want it in my deodorant it has essential oils as dermatologists tested they even recycle so it's 99 percent plastic free and it's made from paper all day odor protection and they're not lying this stuff smells so good it's another scent that's like ginger and something else or whatever girl when i tell you this is the best smelling deodorant i've ever smelled in my life hey humans I don't know what's, you know, I had to order in a pack of three from Amazon. And I don't know what's going to happen after those three are going, girl. But I feel like they stopped making it. Don't quote me on that. Allegedly. Allegedly. I have no idea. But I love this deodorant. 10 out of 10. Do recommend. Try it. So I might have went out of order, but that's okay. So next up we have the Ordinary Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution. So I love this stuff. Um, I've even heard that people have been putting it under their arms. And I tried it one time under the arms because someone said that it helped them to not sweat a lot and have no odor under them. So I even tried that. Like I put it under my armpits one time. And they're right it really does like control like 
sweating, stuff like that under the arms. But I just tried it and haven't tried it again. So it's not something I'm going to keep doing. But anyway, I love this stuff. Like, it is really, it does what it says. It's a, a toner. And, of course, after I do my cleansing, before I put on my serums and stuff like that, I use this. So I recommend this too. I like the Ordinary Products. Recommend. Next up from Naturium, Naturium, we have the Alpha Arbutin Essence 1% Skin Brightening Treatment. I like this. Um, I wanted to give it a try. I use it, you know, of course, after you cleanse, right before you put on your serums and stuff like that. And I wanted to give an essence a try. And so this was the first one that I saw. And so I got it. It was reasonably priced. I don't remember what the price is, but of course, you can find these things. This is my first time doing a video like this, and you can find these things almost anywhere, girl. So, you know, on their site or Target. I feel like I might have got it from Target. I can't remember, or either the um, Naturium site. So, it's not hard to find, but yes. So, basically, I put this in my hand, and then I um, I patted in. Like, pat, 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 right? And so, I patted in. Then I let it sit for a little bit before I move on to my next step of my skincare regimen. So I like this. I have noticed a more dewier look when I use this, and I recommend you too. I like it. Okay, next, after I put my essence on, I put on this is an ordinary ascorbyl blue side solution 12%. It's a brightening serum with stabilized vitamin C derivative. So I like this. Um, I'm trying it out, but I like it so far. I have noticed, you know, a more brightening in my skin tone and things of that nature, but I like the ordinary products. But I wanted to try a different serum. So when this is gone, if you have any recommendations for like a vitamin C serum, let me know. You know, so I can try it out too, because we're here to help each other. But yeah, let me know down in the comments if you have a recommendation. I'm all for recommendations. You almost done, girl. I hope you got you a snack. I hope you got you some water. Get ready. Okay, next we have the Niacinamide Gel Cream 5% and I like this also. It's also from Natorium. Now this claims to, let's see, you got to use it in upward motion, massage gently into your face and chest. For best results you can layer after serums, morning and night and you should wear an SPF during the day. And of course you want to patch test anything before you you know you try it because I'm not a dermatologist I'm not an expert this is just what I use girl and I like this um, it's supposed to help with like your pores also I read somewhere I forgot where I read that at, but it's true I heard that and make them you know appear a little smaller but I really like this also I also notice a difference in my pores and things like that but I like this and again I don't use it every day but um, it's almost gone as you can Feel the 
creamy texture. It's just, it's everything. I really like this. And I had got two because they were on sale. Um, I catch stuff on sale when I can because I'm a baddie on a budget, period. We love that. We love a good sale. So the next one I have is the Belief in Truth, the True Queen. The Belief in. The next one I have is the Belief in Truth, the True Cream Aqua Bomb. It's increased hydration level 70%. So I really like this. Really, really. I had the other one. I think it was white, but I can't remember what the name of that one is. But this is the one that I really has a nice light clean scent so this is the blue one it smells so good i really like this i do recommend this it's a little pricey but not too pricey it's not like up there up there but it's worth it i really like this Now this is a Siesta Eye Repair Concentrate Cream. Um, I got this whenever I had a facial. Um, I can't remember the place, you know, um, that I had the facial, but it's like a chain and they do very well. But it's, you know, just an eye cream for a brightening eye cream. If you have a recommendation for a good eye cream, like a vitamin C eye cream or something of that that you know really really works please put it down in the comments because I'm still trying to you know find one that I like this one is okay but it's not really you know giving what I need I think it's okay it's okay and I also was using this one I heard good things about this one um, it's the rock to reduce wrinkles around the eyes, crow's feet, dark circles, puffiness, retinol correction eye cream. Um, it's never too late to, you know, put your armor on and, and fix or prevent things when it comes to skincare. It's never too late. So I'll also use this, but, you know, sometimes I put them both on. But if you have any recommendations for going, like I said, leave it down in the comments because I'm still on the hunt. This Sephora waterproof makeup remover with cornflower extract. I love this. So like, you know, whenever you have like a full face of makeup and you just want to um, take off the mascara and sometimes it's hard to get that stuff off. Trust me. Even after you use this, you know, this will help it come off. But then I go behind it and use this. I got this from a that was uh, going out of business and I actually kind of like it you shake it up and it becomes one color but with cornflower extract I'm assuming it would like dry the eye out and be too harsh on the eye but I like this so I recommend this I think that's it oh my goodness we are almost done but I, I enjoyed this my first one okay so one of the things that a lot of people struggle with and me included um but i'm doing better now is edges right so what i like to do is no matter how my hair is just make sure that you moisturize your edges girl your whole head really depends on your hairstyle but you know you're supposed to handle that before you do your hair stuff but i like this wild growth oil and I don't saturate my edges, but I definitely, you know, I'll massage my edges because you can still clean your hair no matter what your hairstyle is and you're on them edges. And if not, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, but you know, you wash your edges and then you go ahead and put this on. And this has like coconut oil, olive oil, jojoba oil, rice bran. But yes, I thought was, I like this wild growth oil to rub it in on your I like this um, cuticle oil and I feel like it's called oat and honey or something I've had it for a while and the name it rubbed off unique um, 
bottom i don't know if you can see that it has like a unique slanted bottom look at that and so it helps it to stand i, got the but I love this stuff. that I use it has anti anti sun damage daily moisturizer from Garnier skin active clearly brighter sunscreen so it's SPF 30 I don't even know if that's enough I have to research on that but this is the one that I use I don't know if you can see it anyway if you have a recommendation for a good sunscreen for the face let me know because this is the one that I use now and not to knock it but I feel like I can get a better one than this so just for now this is the one that I have Garnier skin active clearly brighter I heard good things about it but I mean it's a sunscreen so. also I'm using this pixie skin treat so it basically is a brightening leave on mask with encapsulated vitamins help nourish the skin with potent antioxidants and boost luminosity so you just massage it into your face allowing the encapsulated vitamins to melt into the skin and you let it absorb so it's by pixie skin treats it's called the vitamin c caviar bomb i like this stuff and it does have like a good smell to it also and again i don't use this one every day but when i do use it i just love it because it has like a smooth it's almost like you can feel it like melting into your skin love it it's a part of like skin is hair wellness from within i was noticing like some shedding and things of that nature and so i decided to get this now i love this stuff um this is the woman's balance edition they even have some for men also and they even have like um you know after you have a baby or whatever they have a formula for that also but it's the neutrophil and i've been taking this for about two or three months and i love this stuff this is also something else to help my edges grow back honey so i see a major difference using this and i'm gonna keep using this i love it um my doctor said it was okay to take i love this stuff and shout out to my doctor i love her dr osborne but this stuff is you take it four capsules once a day and you take it for a minimum of three to six months and beyond scents and so i have a lot of different scents i have like little um you know little samples and stuff like that because i'm bad on budget no shame but i do love the zora ebony woods it's so it's just lightweight it smells so good i love it it's a part of the Zora Emotion. It's an herbal perfume. I love this stuff. Now I do see a lot of the girls. They'll um, like layer the scents or whatever, and they'll start with like Ebony Woods and put on some other ones. It just uh, it smells so good. I love that. Also, I have the um, the Gucci Bloom, and it smells so good. Like I have the little roller ball, the Gucci Bloom. I'm sure you know what that looks like, but it smells so. I love that this little this was also in my um my my Ulta haul I had to, like a small Ulta haul and it was in here girl smells so good love this also I have the Gucci guilty it's a little beat up so don't judge me but it's this is another one that smells so good I love this perfume and it's it's almost gone it's almost gone it's sad thing that is not skincare one more thing that is not skincare or anything but um it's made it's infused with coconut oil it's this nature's truth lavender spray um this stuff smells so good i spray it on like over my bed and stuff like that when i make it or when i'm about to go to bed or something like that it's like aromatherapy spray this stuff smells so good it relaxes me makes me feel calm mm. I 
I love this stuff. So I do recommend this too. I do have that, um, the Dr. Teal's one, but the, the jury's still out on that one. Um, I heard everybody say, oh, it makes you sleep, babe. You know, but I sprayed it on my sheets or whatever, and I'll let you guys know how I like that. And last but not least, um, I also have the Glow Melanin. I got this when I ordered the the body scrub because I had and I, that was also in my video if you have not watched my video do go back and watch the previous videos that I have and then come back and watch this one but it's the glow melanin goddess yanni oil this has rose petals vitamin e and it's vegan and black owned and made specifically for melanin skin but I'm sure other people can use it too but according to this it just says it's formulated for melanin skin but I love this and um what i find is like you know after you shave it has a nice like i don't know it's hard to describe that smell it smells clean but um after you shave it's good to put this on even like a couple of times a day just to make sure you know because i feel like this helps if you have like dryness in that area or whatever and we know what I'm talking about because I said shame and it's yoni so but it smells so clean fresh and it'll keep you moisturized you know I really like this stuff really like it that's it I hope you enjoyed me seeing what I use in my daily routines you know to keep me fresh clean moisturized and looking fresh face so don't forget to like comment share and subscribe really help me out I'm trying to get to 300 subscribers as soon as I can and then be on there so yeah thank you for watching mm -hmm.